Cowpea seed to seed. Cowpea vigna unguiculata, an annual legume, is also commonly referred to as southern pea, black eyed pea, crowder pea, lubia, navy, frijol, etc. Cowpea was originated in Africa and widely grown in Africa, Latin America, Southeast Asia, and in southern United States. Cowpea seed is a nutritious component in the human diet as well as nutritious livestock feed. The protein in the cowpea is rich in amino acids such as lysine and tryptophan. Cowpea is also used as a green and dry fodder. The variety of cowpea we are going to see is Co CP7. It is a carif crop. The duration of the crop ranges between 65 to 70 days. Preparation of land. The field selected for crop production must not have been sown with cowpea in the previous season. This is done to avoid the volunteer plants. Soil with neutral pH must be selected. Low mark lay loam soils are best suited. Higher organic matter will lead to the production of vigorous seeds. The land is then ploughed. After that, the land is thrown into ridges and furrows of one and a half feet wide or beds and channels of 4 cross 6 depending on the cultivation practices. Basal application of fertilizers. 5 tons of well decomposed compost is spread along the field with a basal application of 23 kg of urea and 125 kg of superphosphate per acre. Selection of seeds. The seeds selected for sowing must be vigorous. The seed rate varies from 8 to 10 kg per acre. The seeds are treated with rhizobium 500 grams per acre or fungicides such as bevistin 2 grams per kg of seeds or trichoderma viridi 4 gram per kg of seeds. Sowing. The seeds are sown at 2 cm depth with a plant to plant spacing of 20 cm and 45 cm between rows. Irrigation. Cowpea crop needs regular and sufficient irrigation. Water is applied immediately after sowing followed by life irrigation on the third day. Then irrigation is done whenever the field becomes dry. Irrigation during flowering, pot formation and seed development are must. Germination. The emergence is epigeal where the cotyledons emerge from the ground during germination. The cotyledons emerge within one week after sowing. Cowpea generally is strongly taprooted. Vegetative phase. During this phase, the shoot portion develops rapidly. The trifoliate leaves develop alternatively. Leaves are smooth, dull to shiny and rarely pubescent. Commonly, the terminal leaflet is larger than the later leaflets. There is a wide range in the leaf size and shape. Foliar spraying of fertilizers. 2% DAP solution is sprayed at 25 to 35 days after sowing, followed by another spray at 40 to 50 days. Weed control. Weed control is of two methods, manual and chemical method. Manual weeding can be done after 15 days. In case of Chemical method, Besalin weed is sprayed by dissolving 2 ml of Besalin per liter of water. The spraying of weed is must be done within 3 days of sowing. Flowering stage. Flowering generally occurs between 40th to 50th day after sowing. Cowpea generally is day neutral. The flowers are born in multiple resins on 80 to 20 in flower stalks that arise from the leaf axle. The open display of flowers above the foliage and the presence of floral nectaries contribute to attraction of insects. Cowpea is self-pollinated crop. Pot formation stage. The pot set begins after 50% flowering, that is 45th to 50th day. Cowpea parts are smooth, 6 to 10 inch long, Cylindrical and generally somewhat curved. Two or three pots per peduncle are common. Often four or more pots are carried on a single peduncle. 
Copy pots are generally green or yellow. Harvest. The pod mature at 65th day and generally harvest is carried on 70th day where the pot color becomes tan or brown. Multiple picking is done during the harvest or we can also go for mechanical harvest. Post harvest. The cowpea pots are taken to the threshing floor where they are threshed and the seeds are collected. In case of small amount of pots, we can easily separate the seeds with the help of hands. The seeds are dried and the moisture content should be 9% and it is then stored in a gunny bag or cloth bag. The yield of this variety is about 400 kg per acre.